Today I'm going to show you a, a really cool feature of the Samsung S4 that comes disabled by default and it's, uh, it's multiple lock screens. And this is really cool because you can add widgets and shortcuts and things to your, your side scroll lock screens. And you can see like by default it's disabled. I can swipe here back and forth and nothing really happens. You just get that little box moving back and forth. If you go into set, we unlock the phone and if you go into settings and then you go into my device and then lock screen you'll have to first enable multiple widgets then you can go in there and tell it what you want to have on your uh, your left or right scroll so you go in here and we're going to tap on that and that's actually the right to left excuse me you can either have your camera or you can have your favorite apps let me show you how to do favorite apps real quick and save that and then we're going to go lock the phone and go into the lock screen and if I scroll over you can see that I can choose what's here by hitting my little edit button down there you can subtract them you can add an app here if you want and uh, let's see here and of course I want to cooperate and you can add anything that you want onto that screen so you can customize it to your needs um, and the other cool thing is if you want some other apps on your other lock screen you can go over here and press the plus button and you can add your email, communications, Gmail, Google Now, messaging, music. There's a whole bunch of different stuff that you can do in here. Now you can't do all of your widgets in here. This is stuff that looks like it's predefined um, by Samsung. But it is some cool stuff. Um, you know, having something like Google Now is really handy. Um, you know, and actually it starts off small like this. But uh, if you scroll off of it and then scroll back to it, well, of course, it's going to make a liar out of me. Uh, right now, I don't have a whole lot going on, obviously, or at least Google doesn't think I do. So, um, but it's cool stuff, um, and you can have multiples. You can scroll over here again. I'm actually going to leave that there, and we're going to scroll over here again, and you can add yet another one if you want. Communication notifications. So again, I got well, I got two new messages. So awesome! I have to go check those in a minute, and um, yeah, that goes kind of on and on. Now, one of the cool thing I just found out today is if you go back into your lock screen options you can actually add shortcuts right to your main lock screen by turning this on then tapping it and uh, you can see you got your phone your messaging google email and your uh, your camera right there on the, the, the lock screen I'm gonna show you what that looks like here so we'll lock the phone again and we'll light it up you can see down there at the bottom get all your icons and you can swipe those up and go straight into your camera look at there so um, very cool feature and it gives you a quick access to a lot of different things the things you probably use the most anyway um, you know if you have any questions by all means post them below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel thanks a lot for watching